what if uh, there's no new point coming in the JD and people are repeating the old points? Now, this is again a very peculiar situation that a candidate uh, might face in the middle of a group discussion. Uh, now, of course, uh, uh, one simple thing uh, uh, that is recorded in this situation is your uh, knowledge or your ability to uh, develop new points. Uh, but still, uh, we follow a particular technique to think on uh, some new ideas when you're sitting in a GD. Uh, now, it has been seen that uh, while sitting in a GD, people face a blackout. They're not able to think of new points. So, this particular technique will probably help them out. So the technique is, uh, we say S square P H E 3 L T I R and this technique is nothing but a memory tool uh, to just uh, uh, recall some, some points here and there. Uh, so it stands for uh, social, sports, politics, uh, the H alphabet H stands for history, uh, the the E's stand for Environment, Economy, Entertainment uh, and Education. L stands for Legal, T stands for Technology, I stands for International and R stands for Religion. Uh, so, uh, to memorize this particular thing, uh, uh, it's, it's a very simple thing, S square P H E 4 L T I R. Uh, now, suppose you're sitting in a uh, GD and you are given a topic like uh, is India a secular country? Now uh, you can uh, talk about secularism from a social point of view, from the point of view of uh, let's say what happens in the sports uh, uh, sector in India uh, in terms of uh, people from different religions uh, playing together and everything. You can talk about secularism from the historical point of view. Uh, you can uh, talk about secularism and politics. You can talk about secularism and the entertainment industry. You can talk about secularism and uh, uh, the economy in terms of the corporate sector. Uh, so we can talk about secularism from all these different angles. Now another technique that we can use apart from uh, this particular technique is 5WH approach. 5WHs uh, ask all the valid questions. 5Ws are uh, why, when, where, what, who and the alphabet H is how. So again, ask all the relevant questions uh, to the topic. Uh, when was India declared secular? Uh, why was India declared secular? Uh, what are the different provisions in secularism? Uh, how the thing was implemented? Right. So I mean, by asking uh, questions, we can somehow come. Uh, we can uh, bring some new points to the team.